I was fortunate to play in the first Fed Cup in 1963, which was held in London uh, at Queen's Club. And they had 16 teams, I think, uh, throughout the world. We were down match points to Australia and won. You had to get into the mindset that you were a part of a team and you had to be definitely more compromising and more unselfish and more giving. And we weren't the stars, but we were part of something. And I think it's a humbling experience to play Fed Cup. Obviously, I'm the player who played the most matches ever in Fed Cup. When you win your first, once you do that, you know you can do more. This was something unbelievable for me when we played the final. The Fed Cup was a something. It's nothing more that you can win in this team competition like this. Playing on a whole team with Chris and I'm actually feeling the same emotions at the same time. Uh, was was pretty cool, so I, I, I love that aspect of it, and uh, that's what made it great. I really enjoyed both being a player, and I and I love being a coach. So uh, I like having those two aspects together, and having a team, and having a, a captain or somebody that you have to strategize. I like that. It's one thing playing on a great team like that, but the other aspect is playing for your country. I think that's something that uh, is is very inspiring. I love to represent my country. It's a privilege and I'm really happy and I think that it's great to, to be part of this uh, great competition. For me, it's very simple. I love Fed Cup. 